Hello and welcome to the update video for Performance version 1.6. This exciting update brings a range of improvements to the app designed to add functionality and improve the user experience. From the main menu, the settings window has been reorganized into new logical categories to make navigation easier. Within the user interface tab, a new light theme control has been added. The light theme makes it easier to see the application in bright sunlit conditions and can be manually controlled using the light or dark buttons. When the system button is selected, the theme color will track automatically with the host machine's setting. Venue files are now automatically stored on devices synchronized with performance. No additional steps are necessary to save the files to devices. Once the software is connected, and synchronizing, the application will push the active venue file to any connected device. Opening files from the network can happen in one of two ways. When the application is first opened, it will scan for compatible devices and venue files. If any are discovered, the software will present a dialog box offering to open the most recent file discovered. Alternatively, if the application is already running, selecting Open from Network from the main menu will also scan the network and then present the newest file discovered. The dialog will display the name of the file saved. Select Open to load the venue file. To then back the file up locally, be sure to do a file Save As. When connected to devices, as changes are made, they are pushed over the network to synchronize devices. This ensures a living copy of the venue file is always available. Within the Settings menu, in the General tab, users can disable the Save to Device functionality if desired. In the product library, the new SRX915SF and 918SF flyable subwoofers have been added. These new subwoofers can be added to subwoofer array system groups, just like the original ground-only models. They can also be added to the array system group to create flown subwoofer arrays. Because these subwoofers are mechanically compatible with the line array models, creating mixed arrays is now also possible by dragging a compatible flyable product into the same array. A white line will be displayed to indicate the new position of the added speakers, in this case, below the subwoofers. The Properties panel for an actively selected mixed array will display controls for both product types within the array. Delay and Preset View controls separate both device types into logical control groups. And within the Grouping panel, the arrays are split into subwoofers and full range speakers for more finite control of both mute and EQ controls. The design import workflow has been reimagined to automate file tracking and simplify the update process. Begin by loading a venue synthesis design file into the import window found under the speakers tab in design mode. Each compatible system type in the file will be displayed. Drag any system group from here into the workspace to import that group. Immediately, a gray reapply icon will be added next to that system group in the import window. After changes have been made in performance to the original group parameters, this button can be selected to restore that system group in the workspace back to the original parameter set imported from Venue Synthesis. After selecting the gray button, performance will display one of two dialog boxes. If the changes from the import are simple and relate only to DSP values, colors, or naming, then users will be presented the parameter scope window. Any parameter set checked here will be restored to the original value. Deselect any of these parameters to maintain the value in the workspace and ignore the original value. If any major changes to the array or device quantity or the device type are detected, users will be presented with an overwrite confirmation instead of an update scope window. In either case, select the update button to reapply the data. Once a file is loaded into the import window, Changes are automatically tracked between Venue Synthesis and Performance. Within Venue Synthesis, if a change is made to the imported design file and saved, Performance will automatically refresh and detect the change. 
any affected system group will display a blue update icon to indicate an updated version of the system group is available. Once selected, the update flow will follow the same rules about whether or not the parameter scope window is displayed. The global update button at the top of the import window can also be selected to simultaneously restore or update all system groups in the venue at once. From all of us at JBL, thank you for watching and have a great show.